breaking ground on the future of mass transit in Raleigh. Yeah, we're talking about the capital city's new bus rapid transit line, the first of its kind in Raleigh. Elena Athens was there as city and county leaders kicked off construction in Raleigh. She's live on New Hope Road, where the big talk today is BRT. Elena. Yeah, right here behind me is where a park and ride location will eventually go with more than 100 parking spaces. And today we did get a first look at what these new high capacity buses look like. So these buses will have designated lanes on New Bern Avenue and they'll be made a priority on the roadway. Riders won't have to wait at a stoplight like you do as a driver inside a car. These buses can communicate with traffic lights as it is approaching and can signal the light to turn green, which allows the bus to quickly roll along New Bern Ave. The corridor route connects downtown Raleigh to New Hope Road. Taxpayers are helping to get this project and others off the ground. A transit referendum was approved by voters in 2016 and residents have been paying a half cent designated sales tax to help fund projects. The city also is receiving federal grant money. The new uh, the New Bern Avenue project is one of four transit projects taking place in Wake County. The county itself is growing a lot and this will help all of the residents that either choose to live in that area or are already living in that area and our current ridership have a more reliable service to depend on. So construction on New Bern Avenue should start early next year and then the entire corridor should be done by 2025. We're live in Raleigh, Elaine Athens, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.